Thousands of frontline workers are getting their protective gear from a group of students and staff at Austin P State University. News Force Shelby Stevens had the chance to talk with one of the students involved. He says he got the idea from social media. They've provided 3,600 people with these face shields, and that number will continue to grow. It's an honor to be able to help them out. Michael uh, Hunter is a junior I graphic design major at Austin P State University. Uh, he works at the GIS Center, where he and his classmates have access to a 3D printer. He was working at the center when the director and a member of the school's leadership team discussed ways to help healthcare workers using their technology. They quickly pulled me in and they were like, hey, we need to start uh, 3D printing these things and uh, figure something out. In three hours, Hunter had printed the first face shield frame. GIS Center Director Mike Wilson says the shields keep workers' noses, mouths, and eyes protected. This is where the virus usually enters the body. It also covers masks to extend the time they can be worn. When the medical personnel um, get a box from us, they'll have one frame, a piece of elastic, get the hold of their, around their head, and then uh, 10 pieces of acetate they could use to replace. Hunter says he's glad he can help people on the front lines working to save lives every day. Seeing and hearing these stories of people being separated from their families and uh, risking their lives over a, uh, a virus. For us seeing others having to do that. And, uh, but it's also amazing to me seeing the, the call to action and uh, people coming back into the medical community that have left um, just to help. Hunter wanted to make it clear that he is not the only one creating these shields. He says faculty and staff are making them every day and they do not plan to stop anytime soon. In Nashville, Shelby Stevens, News 4.